What's going on you guys? My name is Morgan and welcome back to another reaction video. Today we're doing a movie, which I've never done on this channel before, but I've heard nothing but good things about this movie. So today we are reacting to Nioma. Nioma? Mosco just told me how to say it and I already forgot. I want to say it's Nioma. Nimona? Nimona. Maybe that's it. Nimona? I honestly don't know. The first person to actually bring it to my attention was Mosco, aka We, Ask we Last Reacts. Uh, so thank you, Moscow, for bringing this to my attention, and I know Elijah's also reacting to this as well. So I'm the last on the bandwagon, but I've been busy with work, so we're finally getting into it today. Um, I don't really know much about this. I know Nate Stevenson worked on this, and I loved his work in She-Ra and the Princesses of Power. I think Moscow told me this is based off the comic he made. That's good to know going into it. Other than that, I don't really know anything. I know there's like a character with pink hair, and apparently like the animation style is similar to the Spider-Verse. I haven't seen the Spider-Verse, I don't plan on it, so I don't really know the similarities. Before we get into it though, the full movie reaction will be available on the Patreon, the entire movie. So if you want to watch the entire movie with me, it is available on Patreon. If you want to follow me on social media, you could do so here. And with all that being said, let's get into this. Sorry, I keep trying to see if I can see the reflection in the name tag here. A long, long time ago, oh, hello. the kingdom lived in peace. And then something fucked it up. This is, lurking. right off the back, it's reminding me of Shrek. Like when Shrek opened, it was the storybook and the illustrations. That's just what this is reminding me of so far. Oh. The monster attacked without warning, laying waste to everything and everyone in its path. Did it though? A lot of the times the monsters are provoked. Darkest hour, but if you want a happily ever after, you can never let your guard down. Okay, that. The monsters are always out there. Okay, that was that was a deep quote to start off with. But I mean, it's true though, because the moment you get comfortable is the moment you become vulnerable. So that was a deep message right there. To you live from the Glorito. I'm Nate Knight. I'm Alanza Pam Davis. And tonight's the night we knight the night. I heard knight so many times, it doesn't even sound like a real word anymore. You can feel the excitement. And the I love the stylization of this so far. Impossible that is until the queen herself. He doesn't come from a noble bloodline, but he might just have the heart of a hero. Oh, it says that she's believing in someone that isn't born nobility because oftentimes in things like this, we see people with promise are frowned upon and not given a chance because of whatever the classism, whatever it may be. Uh, but it's just nice that this seems like a nice queen we'll see how that goes for the first time in history our safety will be put in the hands of a commoner i don't feel safe i don't it's not like oh come on uh, really have the okay i see the underlying so symbolism here will Ballister be broody on the biggest day of his life I'm not brooding I'm, I'm just oh they're I'm friends thinking. you were better and worked harder than all of us you're oh. gonna be a nice bow. They're gonna love you. Oh. Oh. <laughs> like I do. Oh. Okay. Why am I getting teary eyed? I just met these characters. Okay. That was so sweet, though. Okay. I just need a moment to collect myself. Moscow told me this might be difficult for me and that I might get emotional and. I don't even think that was the part that was supposed to get me emotional, but here I am. <sighs> the sapic cannot deal with this, okay? <laughs> I literally have tears in my eyes right now. <laughs> I'm such a nightmare. <sighs> okay, so these two are together. I shouldn't be surprised N Nate worked on this. I shouldn't be surprised, but it was just so heartwarming. I thought, okay. I need to clear up my eyes here. My Lord Put the, the windshield ladies, wipers on. The is just oh! They're so cute. And I never thought you belonged here. But. And what? Oh, did you think I was going to keep going? You're so stupid. I love it. It's so funny. Hey. Punch him in the face. Punch him in the face. What? Uh, thanks. Hmm. Why is he not as confident as everyone else? Teacher's pet. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what do you mean? You think you did a favor? I get good vibes from him. From Ballister. I get really good vibes. And Ambrosius? I keep wanting to say Ambrosia, but that's a food. 
the lighting. I love the lighting uh, technique they're using. I don't know what it is, but I can appreciate it. Ooh, and the color shift. It went from the light yellows to the blue. That was such a dramatic change in color. So something serious is about to go down. I feel like something bad's about to happen. Like, I'm tapping my fingers together. Your sword. I Why am I anxious I right now? Hero of the There's no clapping at all. Oh, Ballister, I'll clap for you. Oh, okay, okay, everyone. They got on it, okay. I was like, I'll clap for you if no one else. Oh, I'm so happy they're accepting him. I did not think that was the way it was gonna go. New era of heroes I really like the design on the sword. I like the red with the black. What the fuck is that? What? What? What the fuck just happened? He hurt the queen? He lost his arm? Bro, we just started. We just started. I was right to feel anxious. We're not even nine minutes into this. Excuse me? So... The sword must have been booby trapped, I'm guessing, because it didn't look like he knew what was going on. So it looks like the sword was booby trapped or someone fucked with it. Because even when the squire or whatever the hell, the person handing out the sword, when he handed the sword to him, he was like, this is yours? Like, it, he had no confidence where everyone else, he was like, this is yours, this is yours, this is yours. So did that person booby trap it or did someone else booby trap it? And Ballister didn't have... A sort of sign to him it was assigned by someone else and he accidentally assassinated the queen or hurt the queen and got his arm chopped off by ambrosius which i mean it makes sense because his number one duty is to protect the queen even though they're together that's their like that's his like number one duty so i understand why that happened okay i'm sorry this is just a lot to take in we're not we're literally not even 10 minutes into this <sighs> He did kill the queen. Well, not purposely, but because I was like, maybe she's just injured. No, she's dead. Okay. So oh, this is the character I've kept. I, I keep seeing on the internet. He's perfect. Oh, okay. You're looking for someone like that, small child. Oh, he got a robotic arm. Awesome. I just realized, what is it with the shows I watch? What are the main characters losing a fucking arm? What? What? It, like Adventure Time, Finn lost. You know, Ida, the owl lady, owl house, and now this dude. What is the trope with everyone losing an arm? Why is this a trope? <laughs> Ooh, that- you see those reflexes? That's how you know the dude's good at-, at would've been good at his job. His reflexes were like... Nimona. Let me write that down, how to pronounce it. If I say pneumonia by accident, I apologize. I accidentally said that earlier. When I was talking to Moscow about it. Did it bleed a lot? Huh? Did they let you keep the old one? No. <laughs> what is up? The eyes drifting. That was so creepy, but so cool at the same time. This character is chaos, and I'm here for it. I'm I'm for this chaotic energy. How old do you think I am? I don't know, ten. How old are you? All right, help me out. More or less than ten. Not a lot of kids in your life. Is like this person like me, where they just have chronic fetus face? <laughs> On a, a rhinoceros skewering several guards like a human kebab. We love yeah, the yeah. imagination. I saw the visual aid to help you do whatever it takes to get revenge on the cold, cruel world that rejected you. Shall we pillage a village? Lay low until they don't remember you. And then we arise like a fiery phoenix from the ashes to overthrow the government. I love Nimona. I love Nimona. Or we could just talk. Oh, or we could just talk. <laughs> Your sidekick has arrived. I, don't mean I love the design of the fangs. I really love the design of the fangs. I don't know what it is. It really makes the character pop, though. Like, my eyes keep getting drawn to the fangs in particular and the eyes. The eyes are very expressive with this character. Are these your next targets? That's who do you want to kill first? <laughs> <laughs> that character's actually killing me. Oh, my God. <laughs> I laugh because that's me. <laughs> I'm like, chaos? Okay, who, who are we wreaking the chaos on? Who needs to die? <laughs> Oh my god, I, I'm resonating with this character already. Loving it. Wait, are you- 
contact with swords. Okay, so he's he's on to what I was on to because I'm like, did the squire? I, it was apparently the right word. I didn't. I'm not good with medi medieval shit show, so I didn't think I would be right about that. Okay, so he thinks the squire is switched the sword because he had contact with the sword. I think it might have been planted personally. Oh, sabotage sword. Okay, yeah, this dude's okay. So I was onto something because this is exactly what Ballister's onto. Primary suspect is the cocky one that we met that none of us cared for. Are you saying that you're not a villain? Yes. <laughs> Look at the yes, little puppy eyes. No, no, no. Have fun getting arrested. I am not gonna get arrested. No, you might, honey. You might. Yeah, you did. Okay. I trusted you. The queen believed in you. She this is so heartbreaking because he didn't do it. I won't make that mistake again. Oh, the fucking lighting. That Direct. shot, the lighting. Give me a chance. I really like how this show's handling lighting. I gave you a chance. <laughs> no. But I didn't do this. Oh, this is so frustrating. Because it's like you understand their point of view, but you know he didn't do it. I told you. No. <laughs> <laughs> they only see you one way, no matter how hard you try. Are we getting backstory with Nimona? Thank you. Don't thank me yet. I really want to know no, more about this character. Get out of here. Wait, 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 how did you get out? <laughs> That's one way of doing it. Brute force, the way to do everything. Leave. If you see anyone, but I leave. <laughs> if you see anyone, hide. Because we're still gonna break stuff. <laughs> I love this character so much. The chaos, the absolute chaos, just doing the simplest task. Ooh, the red in the eyes, the pupils. About to get some new members. Sit in the dark and move in a room with no toilet. I was not with no toilet. <laughs> Oh, that was the wrong time to say that. Nemesis. Nemesis? No. 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 Nimona, you're making it worse. You know, you know what Nimona's kind of reminding me of? Kind of reminding me of Vi from Arcane. Not gonna lie. It might be the pink hair. Also kind of giving off Jinx vibes. Mostly the chaos. Look, I can get us out of here, but things are about to get weird. About How get weird? weird? I was like, Honestly, they've been weird. If you don't, you're gonna die in this closet. Die. You promise. I promise. Promise, promise? Oh my God. Die in this closet. That, I don't know. I'm getting queer vibes. I'm getting a lot of queer vibes, which is also why I haven't called this character she yet. Because when Ballister called her a little girl, it seemed like they got upset by that. I'm like, gender non-conforming, non-binary, gender fluid. I don't know yet. I'm reserving judgment until we get a better feel for this character. But just the in the closet thing got me thinking out loud now. <gasps> A shapeshifter! You run. Bro, I love shapeshifters so much. Oh, Beast Boy vibes. I'm here for it. I'm here for it. Ooh, I love the shapeshifter route. You guys don't even understand. I love a shapeshifter. I love werewolves. I loved Beast Boy from Teen Titans. Who else is a shapeshifter? Double trouble. I love a shapeshifter. Alright, listen. I'm in, I mean, I was sold on this movie. Now I'm extra sold. There is a shapeshifter. I can't wait to see the other animals uh, Nimona turns into. I'm a girl and a rhino and a lot of things. Things, okay. Oh, the bear was cute. Is that, a, is that a ferret? Oh my god, and a freaking gorilla. Listen, I said I wanted more. I said I wanted more shapeshifts. Immediately got it after. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you, Nate. Thank you so much. Oh, and a freaking ostrich. A whale. That's one way to get to the first floor. Oh, <laughs> The downwards glance cold in here. It's always the egotistical people that are overcompensating. Always. I have the fucking humor of a fourth grader. I'm sorry. <laughs> Nimona, favorite character. Favorite character. I'm calling it. The arson and the ice and the teeth. Oh my god, such a mood. That's a mood, Gabriella. <laughs> That's a mood, Nimona. <laughs> it works.
hurts. How long was I out for? Ugh, 15 years. hours. <laughs> 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 I was gonna say he fell for that so fast. You're what? Marsupial mariachi meatball. You're a meatball. Do not call me that. No, 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 no. Of course not. You, you, Bro, you, she you hasn't know. given you any reason to think she's a monster. She's been helping you out this whole time. Um, mercy. What are you? I'm Nimona. Also, I love the uh, the message of like whenever he asks what Nimona is. Nimona's like, I am Nimona. Like, that's, I am me. I love, I love that. I'm gonna start saying that to people when people ask me, like, what I am. I'm Morgan. <laughs> but I really like that. It, and it's been something she's been sticking with this whole time. I keep struggling with the pronouns, man. I'm not getting cisgender vibes, okay? Like, every time Nimona says, I'm Nimona, it's just... It sticks out, and it's just, it's like, I don't know if empowering is the right word, but I, I do love it. I do love it. Because I'm bored. And everybody hates you, too. Oh, everyone hates you? No, I love you, sweetie. I love you. <laughs> I also just noticed the highlights of the eyes are squares, which is unusual. Usually, they're circles. You need the squire? Then let's go kill, get him. Kill, let's get him. <laughs> kill, get him. <laughs> and I am your official sidekick for ever and ever. No take backsies. Deal? I, I think it's a pretty good deal. Sure I'm comfortable Don't with overthink terms. it. Oh. Don't overthink it. <laughs> the mode is such a mood. Go, you. But I'm not a girl. I'm a shark. Oh! <laughs> I thought they were going to confirm what I was thinking the whole time. I'm acting like common children. Something just occurred to me. The per whoever it is that misplaced the sword, I don't think is a fan of commoners being able to serve the queen or the knight or what I I forgot exactly what they do. Or to cause unrest, like the fact that all of this is happening, it seems is like proof as to why they can't let commoners try and be knights or nobles or I forget the exact terminology, but I, I think you guys understand what I'm trying to say. If anyone can find Bal find Ballister. Oh, he's not using the nickname anymore. This is heartbreaking. I was rooting for them so much. Monster attack. Monster attack. Seek immediate shelter. <clears throat> Institute, we are taking every precaution to keep you safe. I don't trust Please this. Do not Something's not off. right here. This is only a test. Have you ever even been outside the wall? Uh, yeah, because I have a death wish. No, no one has. This is reminding me of a fucking, of something. A TV show or a movie. It's not Attack on Titan, because that shit, there was shit beyond the wall. Strange world! Strange world! That's exactly what I'm thinking of. No, wait, no, wait, they wanted to go outside the wall, that's not what I'm thinking of. There was another thing. I can't fucking remember. But they're like, we don't leave, because there's things out there, and then they left and there was nothing there. Or there was a better world. I can't fucking remember what I'm thinking of right now, but I'm getting that kind of trope here. It bit me. Was it a sea otter or, or a river otter? Are you kidding me? Does it even matter? It bit river me. otters are adorable! So are sea otters, but river otters are better. I believe in river otter supremacy. Oh! Wait! Wait, 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 wait. She can shift into other things? I thought, like, I thought it was just, like, animals. I didn't know it was people. And it's not pink. The form isn't pink. Interesting. I figured it was kind of like a Beast Boy thing, where whenever Beast Boy shifts into something, it's green. Not as much as I hate myself. Not the freestyle jazz. You like jazz? <laughs> Wait. Let it run. Yeah. Something doesn't. Feel Ambrosius. Right. Ambrosius is gonna know that that's not how. Uh, Ballister acts. He knows better than anyone. Look, and he's got triangles for the highlights in his eyes. Does everyone have different shapes? No, they have, they have circles. They have circles. Is it just the main cast? And then there's just a pink rat. Don't worry about it. It's fine. Can you please just be normal for a second? Normal? I just Normal's boring. Easier if you're a girl. Easier to be a girl? You're hilarious. I mean, you're, you're, <laughs> in society, absolutely not. For who? For you. Don't no. Be as accepting as me. 
You said some pretty questionable shit, my guy. I'm Nimona. There it is again. Oh, I love they all look so the style this together. is going with. Held the coin tight, threw it into the well, and made this a is wish. so cool. A wish to, to turn into animals. Be trapped on a subway with an uptight night <laughs> asking me small-minded questions. Wait, wait, so was any of that- was any of that real or was that just Nimona fucking with him? <laughs> oh my god, I'm sorry, it's so funny. Go, go, go! Ooh, the blue lighting. I love the way they work with colors in this. Now you're a boy. I am today. Wait, no! I am today! <laughs> Don't move! Cause if you do, you're gonna miss out on a great deal today! Oh god, not one of these people! I can't find my mommy. The I little boys! Oh, those eyes are adorable oh, though. No. Oh! Wait, he... Okay, he has... I almost said pentagrams, that's not at all. Pentagons? <laughs> Can you imagine pentagrams? <laughs> he has pentagons in his eyes. <laughs> There's no time! <laughs> oh, the child lock! <laughs> nothing. Feels nothing. <laughs> the amount of pineapple on pizza jokes I've seen in the last 48 hours. The amount of arguments I've seen this week alone on Twitter based off of this scene as to whether pineapple belongs on pizza or not would not have me surprised in the slightest if this is how World War III started over this debate, because some people take it way too seriously. That's in, that's in there. Uh, everything's fine. We're just gonna... You're gonna have an arrow in the, your... Don't do pull it out! Don't pull it out! You're not supposed to pull it out! That is worse! No, you're not supposed to pull it out! <gasps> Two. Three. Bro! Not even phase. Oh, I've been through worse. Kiddo, what have you been through? The shape shifting. Wait, does it hurt or does it? He's Sorry. trying to Some understand her. I feel worse when I don't do it. Like my insides are itchy. You know, like that second right before you sneeze. That's close to it. Then I shape shift, and I'm free. Oh my. Okay. It's a whole It's a whole metaphor for dysphoria. Oh my god, don't cry, don't cry, don't cry. I'm trying to hold it together. I'm trying so hard to hold it together. And just knowing that Nate Stevenson worked on this is making that message hit even more. Okay. Oh, I lost my battle. There goes the tear. I lost I was trying so hard. They're not sad tears. I don't know what kind of tears they are, but they're not sad. It's just like, oh, I don't know. It's so meaningful, though. <sighs> no, but that's such a thing with dysphoria, though. It's like feeling itchy and like, oh, my God, it's relatable. Fucking A. That's me when I had to wear female clothing. That, that was literally me when I had to wear female clothing. When I was forced to dress like a girl my whole life. Oh, my God, that resonates so hard with me. Sketchy lady with the buns? The director set me up. The director! The queen. Look, boss, you got betrayed by someone you trusted, okay? I get it. It sucks. But Did you get me. betrayed by someone You're you trusted? The system is jacked. The institute needs to shut down. That's a mood, Gabriella. I need, to, I need to be more open about the people I don't trust, because that that director was giving me sketchy vibes, but I didn't say anything about it, because I'm like, it's just my trust issues. You're crazy. I need to stop doing that because sometimes I'm right. Arm topping is not a love language. You cut off my arm. <laughs> Chopping off your arm is not a love language. <laughs> I mean, in the owl house, it kind of is. <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing. This is how I cope. Um, they brainwashed you good. You think this stops with the dirt? You should be questioning everything right now. The oh, system! The Question the what? system, bro! If we get this to Ambrosius, everything is gonna be okay. No, I'm but, bro, he's been brainwashed just like you were. Mm -hmm. oh, 
this movie's fucking with my emotions, bro. But yeah, see, they're covering up the new era of heroes because now the system's against having people that are not nobility being knights. I think I'm onto something. The director killed the queen. What? Another desperate lie. He's not a liar. They got <laughs> proof, <laughs> motherfucker. Whispering in his ear. Oh, thank you. You're I literally whispering in his ear as you say that. Yeah, I have proof. Uh, he's got a weapon. No! 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 Todd rules. <laughs> Fucking Todd, you're literally useless. What? I just, I just realized, like, with animals, like, when lights go in their eyes, it reflects. Is that why, is that why Nimona's eyes have been like that this entire time? I don't know why that just clicked for me. That's the otter that bit me. Oh, yeah. That's it's the otter that bit me. Look how cute. Look at how cute. I love otters, man. What? You're gonna kill me now, too? You believe that? <sighs> that should be all the proof you need, bro. He spared you. I'm no doctor, but this cast looks delicious. <laughs> you brought milk. <laughs> Instead of breathing fire, it's cereal. That's so funny. <laughs> oh, sh see, see, she's not a monster. She saved you. Monster. That looks like a Shira sword. No, don't call her a monster! Stop! <laughs> she just saved your life, you ungrateful child! I understand you were probably brainwashed, but still. Little kids. They grow up believing that they can be a hero if they drive a sword into the heart of anything different. And I'm the monster? Bro, that's such that's such a message though. To like what like is going on in the world right now. <laughs> Motherfucker, why is it gotta hit? Why is it gotta be so applicable to real life? That's what's messing with me. I don't know what's scarier. The fact that everyone in this kingdom wants to run a sword through my heart. That sometimes I just wanna let them. No! I need a moment. I need a moment. Oh, that hurt. <sighs> Fucked up my hair in the throes of grief. I don't know why I'm replaying this. It's gonna hurt again, I know, but I feel like it's important to rewatch. I don't know what's scarier. The fact that everyone in this kingdom wants to run a sword through my heart. I just wanna let them. How are we not even halfway through this movie? I feel like I've been through the five stages of grief already. Oh my god. First we, we got into it with the dysphoria. And now we're getting into it with like depression and like suicidal ideation. Okay, this movie's coming for me personally. That hurt a lot. This is a fucking kids movie. Okay, we'll go. Together. Together? Listen. It means right so everything. much that he's That's gonna go. Cool. You make me your sidekick. And you can't back out on a deal because you believe in truth and honor and blah, 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 all that. <laughs> <laughs> truth and honor aren't stupid, but all right. So, you got a plan? Of course I got How were we able to bounce back so quick from that dark moment? How did we just bounce back like it was nothing? Bro, okay. <laughs> Protect our way of life. Is that is that what that poster said? I'm a slow reader. Protecting our way of life. The wording in it says it all. The wording in it says it all. That's all I'm saying. It's the fucking government. We need to talk. Alone. Ambrosius fucking stick it to her. Was Bowser telling the truth? Is your loyalty to this kingdom or to a knight who consorts with a monster? It's the fucking... Not answering the question! Is she gonna admit it? Is she gonna admit it? I feel like she might. And the crack grows bigger and bigger bigger until the wall crumbles and the monsters pour in girl that is on you needing therapy that is on you needing actual therapy oh my god i'm getting mad 
I'm getting mad. It's happening. I'm sorry. I keep looking over here because that's where the OBS is. So I make sure everything's still working. I'm mad, okay? Not to question what's kept us safe for a thousand years. But she wouldn't listen. What, by letting a noble, someone that's not a noble Allowing person? Allowing to hold the sword was the first crack in the wall. Oh, fuck right off. And now, you uptight bitch. What about you want to do your kingdom. buns? Let loose a little. You Is uptight. Whoo! I, I don't like her. I'm sorry, I'm gorgeous. <laughs> <gasps> I was just about to say, is she about to fucking stab him? Oh my god. Fucking <laughs> Fucking I reserve that word for very few people, but you're a fucking I killed the queen. Okay, Scar. You Scar wannabe. <laughs> he's, he's pretending. Wait, 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 wait. That's... That's Nimona. That is Nimona, because Nimona doesn't feel pain. That's what the acting is. They got- tell me they got that on video. Please tell me they got that on fucking video. We need to talk. Yo! Bad time. That was impressive that Nimona went in saying the exact same thing Ambrose just was about to say. That's impressive. Which is my domain. Cha -ching. Are they playing Monopoly? <laughs> my Scotty dog will not pay your two rent. Okay, so Even fire breathing is on the table. Fire. <laughs> Metal. Metal? <laughs> two out of three? What? He's so Nothing. accepting. Who kingdom is seeing this thing? All right, I'm going to read the comments real quick. Like, that's unbelievable. Could this be legit or some kind of deep fake? <laughs> this is real. We're all in big trouble. Yeah. Can a shark dance? Can a shark dance? Watch me. <laughs> It's just, I don't even know. Oh, look at the selfies. The fact that people aren't believing it though, like that's, cause that's what happens. Like when shit, sketchy shit comes out about the government in the United States, people still don't believe it. Oh my God, this is infuriating. They better fucking believe it. Who's the real villain? And people are getting upset because they don't want to think what they've been told is a lie. Okay, now some people are believing at least. What kind of sketchy shit is she about to pull? I don't trust it. You're under arrest for the murder of the queen and I'm for Ambrosius. This explains everything. What? What do you mean that explains everything? What the fuck do you mean? What the fuck is that scroll about? <laughs> That's how I sleep. <laughs> According to Elijah. <laughs> Nachos. Nachos? The fuck you mean nachos? Is that a co-word for something? Can I get you guys something? Nachos. Oh, they were actually getting nachos. No, okay. He's allergic. Val. Oh, he's allergic. He's allergic. That is not me in the recording. I know it looks like me in sound. Are they going to say it's, it's it Nimona? not me. That was the monster. Working with the real queen. Fuck Balance. right off! They are trying you conniving piece of That's garbage! Under the best friend, the person sitting next to you. None of us are safe. Now, now she's causing panic and unrest, and no one's gonna tr trust anyone, and society's gonna crumble. I'm not the villain here. I know. I know. You're gonna say Nimona is. I believe you. I'm waiting for it. I'm sorry. For everything. She manipulated you. She manipulated both of us. But together, we'll take her down. What do you mean, both of us? To the king. Her sidekick set you up. What? This was all her plan. This girl has been in the Institute vault for a thousand years. She's Glorith's monster. She's come back to finish what she started, and she's using- Or it could be just be a fucking propaganda tool, and there was never a fucking monster to begin with, and they just saw something they didn't understand, and they made it fit their own selfish bullshit. Why can't you just leave me alone? Because I love you. No, don't pull that card! God, oh. I'm not believing this for one fucking second. I'm not believing it. You wanted them to see a villain, someone else to hate, so you wouldn't be alone. Because you're no. not a sidekick. 
You're a what? No, don't I'm fucking what? say it, dude. Don't, don't, please. <laughs> Something's gonna go bad. I, I feel anxious. The wishing well was true. So even with all of her powers, the animals left her? That deer's so fucking cute, though. Look at that. Oh my god, I love deer. Oh, so she finally made a friend. Someone that wouldn't run away. Oh, this is... Where's the... The betrayal's coming. I remember what she said. She's been betrayed. <laughs> so is this a thousand years ago? Because... It's like more renaissance-y, or I don't know how to describe it. It's more like old-timey than it currently is. Oh, shit. No! Oh, okay, okay, we're good. Oh, <laughs> the little otter is so cute. So she finally had someone that accepted her for being herself. What happened? It's gonna break me, I'm sure. <laughs> oh. Oh, someone else saw and that's... That's the issue? Oh my god. Was I right? Did she really not do anything? Dude, why are you doing that to a child? See, you fucking provoked her, you bunch of assholes. That's where all the fire came from. Yeah, they, they completely twisted it. Go back to the shadows from whence you came. That was her? I thought it was a thousand years ago. See, they fucking... I, I called it. They fucking skewed it to match their own selfish bullshit. She didn't do nothing wrong. They attacked her. Back to the shadows from whence you came. Something oh, shit. This will be interesting to see what what form Naoma takes. Holy fucking shit! What is that? A dragon? Godzilla? Dude, the fucking light inside, like that's such a cool touch. What? 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 Part of that was stay calm. I'm gonna be a freaking hero. You are such a fucking loser. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're real fucking tough. Wish I could say you'd be missed, but that would be a fucking lie. The freaking distorted audio of Monster Attack is very unsettling. <laughs> so Nimona must be, like in the chest cavity, the thing that's glowing. That's my guess. Firing them will take out half the city. Innocent people will die. And so will the monster. But Yo, this bitch unhinged. I'm sure her parents like drove it into her brain that that Nimona was a monster, but oh my god, she's insufferable. Like there's an age where you need to think for yourself, bitch. Oh, the statue porting the sword is gonna remind her of what happened, and that's not gonna be good for anyone, I don't think. Yeah, but notice how she's not attacking anyone right now until you start attacking her. It's very much like what happened in the memory. I don't know what's scarier. Uh, the fact that everyone in this kingdom wants to run a sword through my heart. Uh, Bro, no, you're not about to impale yourself on the sword. You are not about to impale yourself on the sword. That sometimes I just want a little. No, no, please. This is gonna fuck me up. saying earlier like her thoughts being the embodiment of suicide suicidal ideation and the fact she was about to take her own fucking life that is so dark for a children's movie 
oh my god that hurt that hurt but i have tears streaming down my arm from my face see he still likes he still cares about you he doesn't want you to do that i'm sorry i see you in a moment and you're not alone that's what she needed Fire the cannons. Fuck you! Fuck you! I said fire the No. Thank you! Finally! That monster is a threat to our very way of life! And what if we're Yeah, wrong? you're gonna wipe half the population, you f Oh, I hate her! What if we've always been wrong? Are you really about to kill him because he disagrees with you? You are such a fucking <laughs> Fuck you! No. No. The most insufferable I've ever had the displeasure of meeting. That gun's gonna kill everyone. Yeah, who's the real villain? Who is the real villain, bitch? Hey boss, I'm gonna go break some stuff. Yes. Wait, Nimona, what do you- It's time to rewrite this story. Do Nimona. it, do it, do Nimona. it, do it! Yo, she's turned to a phoenix? Go back to the shit! From whence you came. Nimona better be okay. That's all I'm saying. She better be okay. Because if not, you're about to see me ugly cry hard. Nimona. What the fuck? What is that? Are those particles of her? Don't you pull a loose from the owl house on me! No, she's she's gotta be okay. D don't play these games with my emotions. She's gotta be okay. Oh, it destroyed the wall so now they could see there was nothing bad beyond the wall and they've been living in fear their whole life because this crazy bitch was put in charge. Some of us don't get the happily ever after we were looking for. You, no, there's no way she died. Maybe it's not that kind of kingdom. Or maybe it's not the end of the story. It's not the end of the story? She's fine is what you're telling me? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh! Heroes. Oh. Oh. Is that like a little mom? Did she actually die, bro? Bro, now I'm I'm actually worried. Like, is this how they're ending it? Hey, boss. You motherfuckers! Holy you motherfuckers! I thought she was gone. Oh my god. Why y'all gonna play with my emotions like that? Oh. But you can't be playing these games with me, man. I'm too sensitive. I'm glad they got their happily ever after. And I'm glad that bitch is dead. Rest in distress, motherfucker. If you or someone you know is struggling, information and resources are available at www.wanttalkaboutit.com. The fact they put that at the end of the movie. <sighs> Bitch, I have a lot I want to talk about right now, but. <laughs> that was heavy. That was very heavy. That was Nimona. I'm still crying. Um. I don't even know why I'm crying. <laughs> I think it was the message at the end. That was a beautiful movie. I really resonated with that on multiple levels for different reasons just the fact that nate stevenson wrote it and he has spent the last i think like it was like i think he started uh transitioning four years ago but just that he's trans and that he wrote this i think had my mind in like there's some type of dysphoria going on here and when Nimona said, like, not shifting makes it feel like my skin is itching, or that, like, you know, like, the uncomfortable feeling, that really resonated with me, because that's just 
how I've felt a lot of my life, especially when I was forced to, you know, be someone I wasn't. Dressing feminine, like people that went to the charity live stream saw pictures of straight Morgan, which was really just pictures of, you know, Morgan not having access, access to their bodily autonomy and not being able to express themselves the way I would have liked to. So that really hit a chord. So I was really appreciating the like LGBTQ um, representation and also with uh, uh, Ballister and Ambrosius being in a same-sex relationship at the beginning of the movie, um, like usually you wait for that. Like you have to wait towards the end. But the fact that they were in it at the beginning and then obviously like shit happened. So like it was put on pause for a bit, um, but then they ended up together. They had which was really sweet. I can't get over the fact that there were like there was like there was almost like a suicide attempt on screen. Oh, that was heavy. Oh my god, I'm too sensitive for this. Why am I crying again? Why am I crying again? That's like another tie into the, you know, LGBT community is like suicide rates are higher um, for people that are part of the LGBTQ plus community, and. I it's like really striking a chord now because of all the shit going on in the country and but yeah especially with the way things have been in the United States lately um, you know that's the whole reason we did the charity event um, for the Trevor project because they prevent they try to prevent suicide in LGBTQ plus youths and especially with all of the you know discrimination going on right now and the criminalization of just existing it's hitting a lot but that was a really like well-written story and just that the government was you know corrupt the whole time i'm like that's a mood gabriella you know <sighs> like <sighs> just the corrupt government i was like oh, know that trope living that trope buddy yeah just there was like a lot of beautiful meanings and i can't even really talk about it right now without crying the, that bitch was fucking that shit banana is crazy okay it's just that she saw that and she still believed Nimona was a monster all because of a stupid fucking dream she had like bitch that's not right for you to make that call you need if you want to call you should call a fucking therapist because you're little bat shit in the brain bitch like oh that shit pissed me off and it's always those type of crazy fucking people that are put in charge it's like how did you get this far how are you in charge you literally like the world is burning down around you and they're like oh solution crazy person i don't get it i don't and, and she killed the queen because the queen was oh there's gonna be cracks in the wall and the monster's gonna come get us like there was first of all there was one monster and it wasn't even a fucking actual monster the real monsters were the people that kept poking and prodding and oh moscow sent me a voice message oh no but yeah, it, just a lot of meanings. It was so well animated. Like, I enjoyed watching that so much. Beautifully animated. Loved the, the fluidity of it. Loved the stylization of it. Um, people said it was similar to the Spider-Verse. I've never seen Spider-Verse. Spider-Verse, quite frankly, don't plan on watching it because I don't really like superheroes. Uh, in general, I like Batman and that's it. But yeah, it was a very good movie. Uh, very well made. Uh, the writing, very well done. Yeah, I can see why people have been freaking out about this movie, because it was a really good fucking movie. Uh, and so yeah, that's gonna be it. I'm gonna go scream at Moscow for uh, whoever, who knows how long. Uh, so <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you liked it, you know, thumbs up. Comment, comment um, either what your favorite part of the movie was or what your favorite transformation was. For mine, it'd be either, I'd say it's a tie between the otter and the wolf because I just love both animals so much. The deer was also a run runner up because that thing was fucking adorable. But yeah, let me know uh, your thoughts in the comments below as well as your favorite uh, like shape shift or form. And yeah, I'm gonna go. So thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Peace. <laughs>